Hello, my divine kings and queens. I'm back to do another video. And today I want you to know that God is about to move you. See, when God moves you, I don't just mean a physical move. I also mean that of a spiritual move as well. I always tell you that it requires a certain, certain mindset, right? It requires a certain perspective for you to have. It requires for you to have a certain uh, willpower. You understand what I'm saying? To be able to handle what it is that you're going to be faced with on that level. See, God is about to move you again. And see, he's already been showing you and giving you signs that this is going to be that of a physical and a spiritual move. Some of you have been battling and going up against some real negative energy. And see, that only comes about when... The enemy knows that you're right there at your breakthrough, that you're close to your breakthrough, that you are close to this next level that God is about to take you to. He will try to send people. He will try to intervene to make sure that you stay stuck, that he can stretch it, stretch it out for as long as he can. But see, the thing is, these, this, this, this time, this time frame that, that God has for you. It, he's already telling you, listen, you've been delayed enough. It's time to move. So prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. You ain't going to need to take nothing with you because see everything that it is that you had on this level that you're currently on is going to stay right there. Well, this level that I'm taking you to, we don't we don't take anything from the previous levels. We leave it there where it is because I'm taking you to greater heights of your life. You ain't going to have to take nothing with you. Just yourself, just your body. That's all what I need you to take, just your body. He is about to move you. He is about to, to elevate you. This, this, is, this is something that you're, you're, this breakthrough that you're going to experience is, is, is going to be something, like I said, spiritually is in you, your gifts being heightened. It's going to be you stepping into a new phase and cycle of your life where everything can manifest and become clear to you as to why you had to fight so hard to get it. You know, for a lot of a lot of times we, we ask God, we say, well, you know what? I know that you have your other messengers, Father God. I know that I'm just one vessel that you're using. But see, I can't help but notice how I see other people are progressing faster or moving quicker ahead of me. I don't understand why is it so hard, Lord. I see where I, I'm, I'm moving up and then I'm, I'm getting shot back down. I'm seeing where it's, it's, I'm increasing and then I, it's a decrease. And I, I'm, have to, I'm, I'm having to, to really fight really hard, God. And I know you're seeing you're working on my behalf you're fighting on my behalf but why is it so hard what you don't understand is and this applies to whoever like i say it applies to because every everybody's story is different just like your purpose is different your purpose your meaning your destiny is all different what you went through it, and so the thing is, what you went through was on the level that it was on because see this level that this breakthrough is about to be on, this level that God is about to place you on is something out of this world. It's something that was uniquely created for you because of what you went through, because of what he knew you was going to be faced with. Then I tell you, I tell you that God bless you. He knew what you was going to go through because he knew what he had in store for you before you even came into this world. So yes, you had to fight. 10 times harder than that of your counterparts. But what he has for you, what he has in store for you is going to be greater and, and greater than that of your counterparts as well because of how much evil you had to face. Because of how many attempts was made on your life, on your destiny to strip you of that. Um, God is about to, to move you. And see, this move is coming about very soon. You, you, you've been knowing of it. You've been praying about it. And now God is delivering it to you. God is delivering it to you because he don't make promises that he don't intend to what? Keep. It just took some time. It took some time because you were going up against a lot. It took some time because you were in a battle for your life, for your destiny, for your blessings, for your miracles. You was in a fight for what was already predestined for you to have. It don't make no sense, do it? But see, a lot of things don't make sense where we're on this path and we choose to elevate spiritually, right? That means certain things that we probably weren't, uh, that we were closed off to, things that, that weren't made clear to us when we weren't awakened is clear to you now. And the more that it becomes clear to you, the more that it's like, it don't make sense, why? 
It don't make sense why. But when you see, see what's happening, when you, when, when you see what's waiting for you, when you get to that level and you just see like, wow, this is what was waiting for me. This is what was in store for me. This is what you promised me. This is, this is what my reward was the whole time. The reason why it was so much fight that you had to put into it. And I'm telling you, when I say fight, I mean you had to fight. You had to fight along with God, working and clearing things out on your behalf. Because people just didn't want you to have it. Does it mean that all his his other vessels that he chooses, other people that he chooses, his messenger, all the people in the world that he chooses to give a blessing to? It, everybody's situation is different. We all have that of a greater evil that we have to face. Or a different evil that we have to face. But see, in your case, they just didn't want you to have it. They had to make things difficult for you. They, 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 they had to keep fighting you, thinking you was going to give up. But God was, was, was touching you and giving you that strength. So that you would see it through. And so that you would step into what it is that he has for you. God is about to move you. Physically. And spiritually, he is about to move you. And this move is to get you away so that, again, you can start building and preparing for the next phase. But in every phase, all he needs is just for you to take yourself and show up. Show up and start building. Show up, prepare, start building. Show up, prepare, start building. That's all what he needs you to do. He is about to move you. And you're right there. So push through. Push through because you're right there. And what's waiting for you on this level is going to be something that is unremarkable, unimaginable, unforgettable. Something that you've never had or experienced before. So it's going to be well worth the wait. And well worth the fight, God said. Until next time, stay prayed up and be blessed. I love you.